Hey, so I decided I'm going to try to do a recipe video. I'm going to make chickpea uh, cheese. It's my first time, so we'll see how it goes. First off, we start with a half a cup of chickpea flour, half a teaspoon of salt. We're going to do four good heaping uh, tablespoons of nutritional yeast. But not too much. But not too much. That's right. Lila's helping me. Just about a small quarter teaspoon of cumin and the same with a little bit of turmeric, mostly for color, but there's a little flavor in it too. Now Lila's, now Lila's gonna mix it up for us. That's deadly. That's right. Good job. Mix it up good. I am. Oh good. And then we put half a cup of water in. And then stew it. And then stir it up. Yeah. So I decided to add a little bit of paprika, so Lila's gonna stir this up for us. And that's how it should look. I've got half a cup of water, just a little under half a cup of water because I want the cheese to be firm. Getting ready to boil in my pot here. As you can see, and then we'll put, pour our mixture in here slowly and start to stir. So now that our water is boiling, we'll pour in our mixture slowly. And I am helping. Mm, you are helping. Ooh. Ah. Whoa. This is pretty gross. It's pretty gross? Oh, the mess that's on the cutting board? Yeah, on here too. Oh, wow. So I just want to clean it. Okay, you clean it up. <laughs> and we just keep mixing and mixing. Get all our mixture in there. And keep cleaning. Turn this down just a little bit here. Yeah. And what's this? Yes. Oh, do I clean up? Well, I need the fork to stir. <laughs> yeah. This is how it should look. No nice and firm. He's okay. <laughs> and then we'll pour it in just a moment. Let this sit up just a little so bit. So I just chose one of my old ramekins and getting it on here and press it down. Get it nice and smooth on top. It's all done. Almost. Make sure to tamp it down if you can to make sure you get the air bubbles out. So then we just, you can let it sit out at room temperature, but if you're in a hurry like me, I'm going to let it set up in the fridge for a little bit. Should be ready within the hour. While Lila cleans up the mess. Oh, good job. So here's the finished product. We obviously got some air here and it's not perfect, but it should be totally edible. Nice and firm. Now we're going to cut it and see uh, how it tastes. You ready for cheese, Lila? Mm -hmm. Yeah? You okay? Okay, here we go. Let's do a little bit. Let's just cut a little piece like this. Oh, look at that. Whoops. All right, here you go. Try that. Uh huh. You like it? It's really good, huh? Yes. You want some for your sandwich on your lunch tomorrow? Yeah! All right. Here, Finn, you want to try some cheese? Mmm, is that good? Is that good? Yeah. <laughs> and now for my taste test. Wow, that's real good. It's good, huh? Yeah. Wow. That's really good. Yeah. 
Wow. Well, anyway, uh, that's the cheese. You can experiment and put oil or other um, other things like. Uh, I, wow, good job. Like apple cider vinegar and uh, other spices, herbs, uh, jalapenos, whatever you like. And uh, let me know if you've tried it and see how it comes out. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Bye.